But no, marry me. So, um, it's gonna be a somewhat of an unusual video. It's about phone cases. Now, a few months ago, right before Christmas, my trusty old mobile phone finally died. I have a tendency that I use my phones until they fall apart, and eventually it just wouldn't work anymore. And that was just this plain old phone I had gotten for, I think, 20 bucks uh, at a local hardware store. So it was nothing special. But my mother said that she would buy me a smartphone. And the smartphone she would get me were a uh, um, were, um, Samsung Galaxy S. Four, yeah, four. So I thought, finally, I can play around with cases because I really think that various forms of phone cases are so cute. So I sort of went a little bit overboard. Now, before I start, I have to say that I've not spent a lot of money on these. They have been all from two dollars and up to, yeah, there are one or two there that cost a little bit more, but for the most part, they are. Uh, from one to one, uh, one or two dollars to six or seven dollars. There are none of them that's hugely expensive. So, let's start with the case I have on my phone right now. And it's this one. And I mean, if you have seen any of my jewelry hauls or a lot of my videos, you know that I am obsessed with spikes. So when I saw this spike phone case, I just had to have it. What I don't like about it is that it has no bump up here. Basically the reason why you would want something that has a few millimeters of bump is that when it falls down that, it hits that bump and not the screen. But I do have other protections on it, so that's fine. And I mean, these are pretty decent spikes. So yeah, I have that one. I can get it back into the little bag I keep it in. Keep my phone in this bag. I also have a um, actual little purse now to have it in, so that the screen won't get scratched. Let's see. I have this one, and I got that because, as you can see, it's a skull, and I, it reminds me of chocolate. No, I can't have chocolate anymore because I've gotten allergic to sugar, but. I mean, I still like chocolate, so I thought that was so cute. So, it's a very, very cheap case, and you can feel it. It has a little bump there, and it's very flimsy. But the design is cute. And when I saw this, I just had to have it. And this one is the only case I'm really disappointed about, because this one was one of those I paid a little bit extra for. And it's perhaps the flimsiest one of them all. And it's the design is so cute. It's a panda witch on a broomstick. It says abracadabra. I mean, and it's this nice purple color. I mean, seriously, that just made me squeal with cuteness. But it's so flimsy. And I mean, this company has another case I really want. Uh, head case goods there. And which is basically a lot of chibi bats. A flock of them that fly down, little fat chibi bats. But seeing the quality of this one, I'm not so sure if I want to buy the other one. And this is one I just had to have. Now, Ariel is my favorite Disney princess, and here we have her as a zombie. And, um, yes. Then I, this is the newest one I got. And I just thought this was so cute. It's, um, what are these called? Sugar skull. It's a sugar skull with taco brains. I mean, seriously. And I mean, I tried to get this for several months, but I wasn't gonna pay a lot for it, so I continued to buy it. It's a two. Bid three dollars. So I didn't get it. Three dollars didn't get it. Three dollars didn't get it, and eventually I got it for two seventy. And then I have this one, which is basically 
yes, your average Grim Reaper type image. And when I saw this one, I had to have it. It's just too adorable, and I've gotten something on it. Annoying. Anyway, let's shine it up a little bit with my scarf because I can go that in the washer. I mean, it's an X ray, so it's an X ray skeletal hand that shows you the finger. It was just so different. Let's have that one. And I really, really like cats. Cats are my favorite animal. So, I got this. Okay, it's, and this is the first case I got that is this rubbery substance. The other ones are hard. But yeah, it's basically fluffy. Follow it as fluffy and it has this little fluffy tail. I would have preferred it if this part was silver because I like silver tones much better than gold tones. But yeah. And this one is the one I paid the most for. And I know that when I when my mother told me the model she was gonna buy for me and such, I went on eBay to look for a case for it and I saw this case and I thought I have to have this case. So it's the first one I got. Been wearing it on my phone a lot. And it is basically the sign is sideways. And it's this scrawny undead cat out in the moon. It's just so cool. And this is a good case. It's sturdy quality. The edges go a little bit over the phone. So yeah, I really like that one. And I got this one. I was very lucky. I think I did like two dollars for it and I got it. It's this case that you can open like that and you have your case there and you have room for your various various uh, cards and such there so it's a very nifty little thing first of all it will close with this magnetic tape and first of all it will keep the screen on this phone safe but it's also very useful because putting your cards your credit cards and such here your phone just throw this in your purse, you're good to go. And it has this anime girl who kisses a skull. Same design on both, but I like that. And this is my other rubbery case. It's just found uh, lots of green skulls. So, I mean, I thought that was cute. And I have this one, and when I saw this, I just thought this one is for me. It's this fantasy image, and it has this girl with that just sits in this fantasy landscape, and she actually knits with her own hair, and her long hair is everywhere. I thought, for somebody who is interested in long hair, this is perfect. So, yeah. Got that one. And I got this one, I don't know how that will show from the camera. It's basically an anime girl and it has this action so you tilt it and the image changes. And I have another of those. She's also an anime girl. The roses are on there, tilt the sun changes. And another one of those that you tilt, which is the skull in a uh, spider web. This one is my favorite of those tilty tilty ones. And I have the last one of these is this fairy or mermaid anime style. And yeah, here you can sort of see the action. This here, they all come from the same company and they are good cases, they are very sturdy. And then I have this one which is just a bunch of sugar skulls. And this one with has a sort of like 
well with the feel to it. I mean, I think it's the same finish that I have on those books that I really hate. But while on paper it feels so slick and odd and strange and I don't like it, I sort of like it when it's on plastic like this. And it's just I keep calm and kill zombies. Now this one doesn't look that good on my phone because my phone is black and of course the case is white, but I still think the design is cool. And the last case, what is this one? And yes, this case just made me think of an Apande, which is sort of like a twisted order of mages in my favorite role-playing game. And for, because they have a tendency to have these strange mutations like mouth coming out of their faces in odd places and eyes coming out of their buttocks and all of those crazy things. I thought that this, which is a skull, and the skull has a rose for an eye and there's a mouth coming out of the rose. That just reminded me so much of the Napande. So yeah, those are the cases I got. And I think, let me check if I haven't forgotten any because sometimes I go. Stick together. Oh no, they're sticking to my scarf as well. So yeah, and as like I said, I haven't spent a lot of money on these. I bought pretty cheap ones. I mean, do I want one of those? I saw like this amazing one that had just had a lot of embellished skulls with rhinestones coming out of everywhere. Did, do I want one of those? Oh yeah, I do. But, there's a limit to how much I'm gonna pay for a phone case. It seems like I have shown you everything, yes. So, yeah. Hope you have enjoyed this video of my little phone case haul. I'll make another one if I do uh if I get a lot when I collect up a lot of phone more phone cases. I mean I, it's not like I buy huge amounts of them every single month. I like see one if I find one cheap and I might pick that up and so on and so forth. So I don't know, you know around Christmas perhaps, I don't know. When I get a few more enough for a haul I'll show you some more. So yeah. Have a great day. Blessed be.